Oh yeah, no, I don't know. It was weird because before I met Helena, I always thought. I remember meeting this couple on a holiday, and they had like gotten uh, they had gotten married after knowing each other five days or uh, two weeks or something. And I was like, wow, morons. It was like literally the first thing I thought because I was like 20 at the time, 23, and they'd been married 50 years or something. And he was like, when you know, you know. And I was like, you actually do sometimes. Was it Tai Tai? Oh, uh, so I saw this girl and then I married her. The end. I pull up, I pull in, I pull out. Huh? I saw this girl and I was like, log in, dude. <sighs> okay, level four, please. Level four in power. Yo, that is so big. If you ever feel like you're not able to catch my stream because I'm streaming at bad hours for you, we're actually introducing a VOD channel. If you want to watch the full VODs and what happen at your own leisure, we got you covered. Right, so now we need to drop the bottom right fragment. Obviously, I want to watch Resign, but right now all I care about is the bottom right fragment so that I can have all my four white stones. And we'll just do your real quick. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Any advice? Move in circles when fighting the boss? Don't backtrack? Like running like this and then back and get you killed. And going fast through the traps is usually safer than going slow. Cause like the best way to think about traps is that they don't have a big enough surface area to kill you, right? Like if you're sprinting through with a quicksilver, like you want to be careful that you don't get bled, that can kill you. But the surface area of the traps are very rarely enough to kill you. Whereas most people end up dying from backtracking. Bottom right, bottom right, bottom right. Oh, we got bottom right. Uber Elder time. I wonder how my build will be for Uber Elder because there's two targets. Do it, he won't. Oh well. Yep, Dave Carter said I Please watch your eye.
Ooh, drops out of that. Um. Other. Discipline, clarity, unaffected by poison, malevolence. I like the poison, but not when it's not paired with anything else. Um, I guess the faster shield recharge is good for discipline, but it's not something I'm very likely to use. It's good for EB. It's just such an issue, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna use that one. Almost good. Um, they're both good with other stuff, but they're not good on their own. So like the unaffected by poison, well, malevolence, that's huge. As long as there's one other good stat on there. Like, it's not something I would use with just that. The mana recovery rate, well, clarity is actually pretty useful. Uh, if I do a mana build this thing. So, so that enables some things, but it's a, it's, it's, it's a non-ideal one. All of those stats are good with something else good. They're not good on their own. Uh, but I got the fourth one now, so now I have tier 16s. It was like TwitchCon London, it was like me, Nano, and Nuts sharing a room. And it was like a fucking tiny room. It was literally a third of the size of my streaming room. And the fucking toilet didn't close, so when I was taking a shit, the door was like not fully locked. And I was like, this fucking sucks, bro. It was awful. Like everything was so expensive in London. You do have a shady vibe? No, I don't. I'm very nice and nice. The jail special. <laughs> Old Ziz seemed a lot more shady. Yeah, people kept accusing me of like selling drugs. I've never sold drugs in my life. Maybe it was the dyed hair? No, even before. But then I used to wear a trench coat. Like Jane, Silent Bob or The Matrix. Maybe it was the trench coat. Oh. <laughs> How do you manage to meet a Dane online or was she already in the country? So, um... We met on Bumble and she wasn't even sure if she wanted to date or if she just wanted to find friends and stuff to like explore the country. And she had a hard time lately with relationships. Like generally her relationship wouldn't last more than three months because like people wouldn't give her a lot of space and she needs a lot of space. And then a friend of her that like a friend of her that did a lot of dating was like, she was on Tinder and Bumble and stuff. And she was like, you should at least try Bumble. Oh shit, I got the divine mod. It's not really a good map for it, but this is huge. Oh, that's so nice. I'll get some divines. At least if I get four, I'll be happy in this map. Cause I have like no uh, pack size or anything, but like it's just free divines. I can't, I can't complain. Never heard of Bumble, but nice. Yeah, no, it was really good. And um, we went on a date and uh, it was okay. We both had a good time. Halfway through the date, I was like, can I kiss you? And she was like, yeah, why not? And um, then we went to a bar and she kissed me at the end of the day. And we both weren't that keen on each other. We were both like, ah, I don't know. But then uh, I got sick and then I had to go to TwitchCon. And we kept talking and then she wanted to like, she wanted to do a second date just to say that she wasn't interested in anything except friendship. But she said, I looked like somebody that had enough friends. And then because we couldn't meet up for another date, she started liking me more and more. So basically this affected her. And then I started liking her more and more too, just by chatting. So yeah, this has affected her. Works in real life too, be careful. Yeah, I'm like a ramping. We have three already. Like, like I said, I'm happy with four, man. Like, I have such, like, dog shit pack size on this. Give me one more. And then, oh, it was because, um, it was because we did another day. I think the next day was at my place. Um, cause I wasn't feeling too good. And she was like, well, I can come over and hang out anyway. And she wanted to kiss me, but I was sick. So I didn't want to kiss her. Um, and on my second day, I was just in like tracksuit bottoms and just like really comfortable, like basically wearing pajamas. And she was like, she was like fully dressed up, like to look really nice. And then she, she thought it was like pretty impressive just how comfortable I was. She was like, 
I was like, oh man, you like dressed up and shit. And she was like, comfortable is sexy. And I was like, man, this woman's great. How does that divine mod work? Um, so there's two. You can get like the boss drops a specific amount of divines. Or you can get monsters have a 2% chance or 4% chance to drop divines when you kill them. And it's just RNG. And then you want like high pack size and stuff like that. And then you could also have these mods which like make it like, like additional. Honestly, I might take the notable. Th this map isn't that good because I'm I'm not running a specific map or a map like set up to get more out of it. That's why I said I'd be happy if I get four. Uh, but it seems like I might get more. So I'm I'm very happy already because it's not like crazy pack size. It's not well rolled. I was happy with four. I'm already at five. I could have had double the amount though if I had the no dog. I will, I will do that next time, actually. I think that's it. Five. That's one more than I bargained for. So we're happy with that. Where are the buff monkey souls gone? Which ones? You have wandering path? I do. But I can still take the keystone. I just can't take the uh, rampant growth. Yeah, we just we just like kept dating. And then pretty fast, I introduced uh, Helena to like Rose and stuff. Rose would do like vetting. She like vetted every girl I dated. And the one time I didn't listen to her... There's a girl I called Crazy Eyes, and Rose was like, don't date that girl, she's got crazy eyes. And it was crazy. I only dated her for like three months. And then she was like, at one point she was like, oh, by the way, you don't need to use a condom. I can't get pregnant. And I was like, huh? Like, why? Are you sterile? I was like, no, I just can't get pregnant. I was like, oh, uh, okay, definitely going to use condoms. She was pregnant uh, a few months after we broke up. I was like, ugh, Christ. This always goes fish mode when focused. Yeah, my mouth opens. It's weird because I don't even breathe through it. I wonder why. Still farming Alva. Right now we're farming Master Missions, Elder Guardians, Shaper Guardians, Synthesis, and Master Missions, yeah. Need more incursion shit. Oh shit, I just got another fourth vial. That's so big. I can't do this just yet. that's Bulgarian, not Russian. Oh. Scion. Bane of Legends. Another hot American trash. Churros are trash? Sorry, I think it's a trash instead of take because that's what it is. Holy f dude. Imagine being so ignorant that you think churros, the most beautiful and wonderful thing on the planet, is trash. Holy shit, dude. That's the type of take. You should be launched into the f***ing stratosphere for that. Churros are f***ing amazing. Holy. Talk about being objectively wrong, dude. There are some things that you just don't say out loud, dude. I, I can't even map anymore. I'm like literally shaking right now. Look how delicious they are. Literally look how delicious they are. Just look at them. Covered in sprinkly, sugary, cinnamon goodness. Mmm. Look at that. How can you not like that? Honestly, like, if you didn't like churros, somebody probably pranked you and instead of chocolate, literally shit in a bowl. And you dipped it in shit and that's why you didn't like it, which is understandable. But this is like so delicious. This is so good. There's no way anyone doesn't like Like, look at them. Like cinnamon, mmm, good. Sugar, mmm, good. Dough, mmm, good. It's, I just, I just can't, dude. I, that's like, oh my god. I, I just, I'm, if I wasn't sitting down, I would need to sit down. Ban him? Ah, oh, well, like, banning isn't even enough, dude. He should be force-fed churros until he likes them. I literally can't even right now. Nuke his house? Yeah, see, that is a more appropriate response. Oh, shit! 
Speaking of nukes, I just got a covenant. I really need that on hardcore, but still I have one. Uh, I've been there a lot, right? So I knew what mall I was going to. And then uh, he started driving the opposite direction. And like he spoke English when I was ordering the taxi, but then like, and like before and when uh, explaining where I was going to go, he was like, yeah, no problem. But then as soon as he started driving, he was like, oh, no English. And he was driving the wrong direction. So I like, I just, I started calling the tourist police and he was like, oh, no tourist police, no tourist police. And then he uh, started driving me to where I wanted to go. And I was like, wow. Abducted? No, it was more that he was kind of... Um, I wasn't... like I, That that I wasn't even worried about. Like, that wasn't what was about to happen. He was just going to do a shitty route and drive me for a lot longer to make the meter go up. Feel death's grip. Death will never come for an immortal. Yeah, he, he was just running the meter. It wasn't like he was about to f***ing kidney me. More. But it's like... Veil for your base desires. Hypocrite. Your Hypocrite. Your Honestly, I feel like they could have made the voice lines a little bit more different than give your soul to me and your soul is mine or whatever. Like they're so very right, right, annoying. Oh, yeah, give your soul to me and what's the other one? Your soul burns for me. Rub potions. Actually, Neo is pretty easy because of Uber. Uber is really nice when you're somewhere where you're unfamiliar. Very you fun Uber. Yourself to be purer than the others, better than them, but death. death yeah, I don't want to rip right as I'm about to end. He's about to slam me. You can still Please me. pray for me, chat. It's your chance to bring Helmet. Anyone you've ever loved or cared about. Just give me a shut up. Ah, uh, uh, that's like twelfth Katarina I've done.